Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kids of all ages, welcome back to episode 44 of RB Plays FTB's Revelation Pack. That's right, folks, we're back in our modded world. We're doing all the cool modded things. I am your host, RB Plays, on this side of the screen. Thank you so much for stopping by. If this is your first time here, please do consider hitting that subscribe button and get notified every time we put new content up on the channel. So uh, so last time we were together, we uh, we did a couple of things with Batania, and uh, I would like to do one more thing with Batania, and then I need to get back into some Thaumcraft stuff. Um, but we opened up the uh, the portal to Alfheim, right? So we were able to get into some of the uh, uh, some of the more advanced things like uh, making uh, getting pixie dust and and upgrading our 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 our, uh, our, our Lexica Batania. Yeah, I'll get, I'll spit that out eventually. Um, today, uh, one of the things that I would like to do is I would like to upgrade my mana spreaders. I only have three of them, so uh, I'd like to upgrade the mana spreaders today. And to do that. Uh, in order to get the upgraded mana spreaders, you have to get some Dreamwood, and you also have to get Elementium. Um, so, and you need one piece of Elementium per mana spreader, and you need six pieces of Dreamwood per. And since we only need three, that's pretty easy math, right? So I just need three pieces of this, and I need 18 pieces of this. Um, these are a one-for-one -one trade in the Elven Portal, right? So in order to get these, you just take a piece of Living Wood, throw it through the portal, and you get Dreamwood back. The, uh, uh, the, the, the Elementium is not quite as straightforward. It's two pieces of Mana Steel for every one. So basically what I have to do is I need to get six pieces of Mana Steel. Six pieces, uh, not, not those. I need six pieces of you. So one, two, three, four, five, six of you. And then also uh, Living Wood. I need 18, uh, 18 of you, right? Yeah, I need 18 of you. So if we take these over here to our portal, to the portal, um, we should be able to do this. We should be able to get these back. So six of you. Yeah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about. There's our three of those. Take 16 of these and throw them in there. We get 18 of those back. I love it. Wow, that was that was all. That was kind of a cool little transaction. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's only 16. Why did we not get 18? Are there more here that I'm missing? I'm going to say no. I'm going to say no to that. Did I only put 16 in there? I think I probably only put 16 in there because I'm a derp. Uh, living wood. Just need two more. So one, two of you. Let's go do that again. Try that one more time. <laughs> Make it so that it works. Yeah. And we'll get these guys upgraded. Then I want to go and do some uh, some Thaumcraft stuff, right? I found, a, uh, I found a place. I found a place that I want to put our Thaumcraft base. It's right over there. Well, it's a thousand blocks away. So we're going to have to do... Uh, we're going to have to do some stuff uh, to make this work, right? So it's going to require some technology. Ooh, technology in Thaumcraft. Hmm. Um, I don't know if we're going to be able to pull it off or not. Oh, also, by the way, I was talking about, I was talking with you guys about a good way to get gas tiers. Hello, we got this recipe right here. Boom, boom, and boom. Hey, look, it's a gas tier. We're getting these for free from the mob farm and basically any other creeper that we kill. So might as well uh, just go that route. Yeah, because, eh? Why not? Uh, anyway, so onto this uh, onto this mana spreader. So mana spreader, the Elven mana spreader, to be specific. We'll get to the Gaia one eventually, I hope, because I've never fought a Gaia. We probably should do that, right? Uh, so give me you, and you guys go in there, and you guys go in there, and mystical white petals. Eh, how many mystical white petals do I have? Petals. How many petals in general do I have? I've got enough. I got enough white ones, but I'm gonna trade those out for for the light blue ones, because I got more of those. That seems to be the one that I have the most of. So we just need one, two, three of those, right? Right. Let's go ahead and swap these around. Um, do I have a block that I can use? No, let's get a block. Any old block will do. Uh, like even this dirt block will be fine. Yes, yes. So we'll put you there and we'll put you there and then we'll get these guys and we'll just kind of actually those are easy this one here is the hardest one right so we'll put you there and then we'll break you yes please and then we'll put you right up there like so and we'll break you and we'll do this 
and that'll do that. So basically what these do is they actually transfer mana at a faster rate. So, uh, and, that's, and that's kind of what I'm looking at, right? So this will hold more mana. I think it holds more mana, and it also transfers mana a lot faster, right? So that's, that's, kind, of what the, that's kind of the gist of these. Um, let's get this and do this. And then do this, right? Yep. And then break this one. this and then do this and do that so those have now been upgraded sweet very sweet hopefully that will fill this up a little bit faster right hopefully the transfer rate will become a lot nicer on this i'm probably going to need to upgrade these flowers to something better uh, as far as mana production but i mean i did add a few more so we've got eight of these all together so we're doing pretty good now on to the Thaumcrafty stuff, right? This stuff here, um, this stuff here is not going to stay here. It never was supposed to stay here. It was never supposed to be here. I was looking for a good place to put a uh, to put a, uh, a Thaumcraft base, and I think I found what I'm looking for. I'm pretty sure that I have found exactly what I need. So what we're going to do is we're going to get a couple of power cells. For now, we're going to get a couple of power cells. I got one of you, and I got one of you. Are these both on the same power network let's put you wait a minute uh where did my other where did my other mana pool go or my other uh oh did i lose one of my mana spreaders i think i did yikes anyway no big loss right we'll put those away and uh, we want to check and see if these are on the same network so you and you one can go there one can go there. You are on link ID one. You are on link ID four. All right. Well, let's just change that. You come over here. You go to link ID one and you go there. So now you guys are on the same network and I love it very much. Uh, we're going to need also uh, some other stuff because we're going to want to get our applied energistics or not applied energistics, refined storage system out there. And, um, I know I've been avoiding this, right? I know I've been avoiding this, but I think I think it's time to not avoid our uh, wireless in our refined storage system. So uh, at refined storage, uh, if you do refined storage, you can do a network transmitter and a network receiver. So network transmitter that needs to go on this end, on on the end of our of, on the end of our system uh, where the system is located, and then the network receiver that's gonna be out at the remote location. These are pretty straightforward to make, uh, but I do wanna make some patterns for them because we're probably gonna end up making more of these as time goes on. So let's go to, uh, let's go to our pattern area, uh, which is uh, down in the old uh, wither skeleton farm. So if we go here and here, I also need to make a matter receiver so that we can teleport out there. Uh, wither skeleton farm, go. We probably should, we should probably charge this maybe anyway um so anyway network transmitter that's this guy we're gonna go ahead and make a pattern for that store it yes please we're gonna get a network receiver we're gonna do that store it yes please right we're also going to get a matter receiver since we've since we seem to be using these a lot i'm gonna go ahead and make a pattern for that as well i don't know do you know how to make machine frames? M-A-C-H-I-N-E. No, you do not. So let's teach you how to make machine frames from RF tools as well. And that, as they say, should be that. Put you down here in our crafter manager. Uh, so we'll put you there. We'll put you there. We'll put you there. And we'll put you there. Yes. Yes, please. Sounds like a plan. Let's get a... Uh, let's get a matter receiver going right give me one of you thanks that's done <laughs> that's sweet uh, let's get a, a transmitter start this might take a minute because of all of the things that it's oh it's done good all of the things it has to make uh, I did put speed upgrades in all of the crafters so that should be, uh, they should, those should be about as fast as they can get now. And then uh, network, uh, we have the network transmitter. We just need the network receiver, right? So give me one of those. And there's also some other stuff that we need for this too. I, I don't remember exactly how this works. So we're going to have to find out um, what, 
uh, what what we're trying, what we need to try and you know how, what we need to make this thing work. Like it's been a long time since I've used one of these. But let's head out. Uh, let's head out to the uh, to the magical forest, right? If we go to our map, right? I put, I found a magical forest over here and I found a nice clear spot. It's got some lava. There's a great wood tree. Uh, there's some silver wood trees and some other stuff. And uh, the reason I want to put this in a, in a magical forest is because the V, the V-I-S, the V, the magical aura, if you will, um, for Thaumcraft is stronger in those areas. So I'm going to go ahead and sleep the night away. I'm going to go ahead and head on out there. We're going to get all of this stuff set up, and then we're going to see what we got to do to finish up getting access to our, oh, you know what we should probably also have? We should probably at least have a, uh, a grid out there and also some conduits. So let me go ahead and craft up the uh, grid because it's an auto craft thing. Let me get this uh, sleep the night away, head on over to the base and I'll come back to you guys in just a minute. All right, so we're closing in on the Thaumcraft base. It's not that far from home. Uh, so home is what? Uh, it's, it's about a thousand blocks, right? Um, but I found a nice little spot here. There's the great wood tree that I was talking about. Uh, we've got a uh, silver wood tree right over here. Uh, we've got some mushrooms. We've got uh, other stuff. We've got, you know, pigs and stuff. But right here, I thought that this was a pretty decent spot, uh, if you would be so kind, as to put in our uh, ye old Thaumcraft base. Let me get my, uh, let me get my horn. Uh, and actually, we're going to go ahead and put the horn there. We're going to go ahead and blow this guy. Didn't sound right. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, and and make it so that uh, all of this stuff, <laughs> all of this stuff gets cleared out. So boom, 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 and boom, and get rid of you, and get rid of you, and do that, and that should be cool, right? So right there, this block right here, this is gonna be, uh, this is gonna be where our matter receiver is gonna go. We're gonna put that right. Oh, I forgot to put power back at the base. Well, that's all right. We can get. We can fix that. So we'll put you right down here. Get you like that. So you should have, you have no power. Uh, out on all sides. Yes, you should be getting power. Sweet, you should be draining power, but not that much. So that's cool. Um, now we want to set up uh, the basic, ooh, ooh, excuse me, the basic starting point of, uh, of all of this stuff, right? So to start with, we're going to take and we're going to throw that in there. Uh, we're going to take and get our matter receiver, our, our network receiver, and we're going to put him, uh, I'm going to say over this way. I'm going to say over, th over this way, right? I don't think we need to be like right on top of, what in the world is that? Is that burning? Why is that burning? It's not supposed to be burning. Uh, what are you? Ambient grass block. Ooh, that's a Thaumcraft block right there. That's cool. Um, I'm going to put you here, right? And then I'm going to take this guy. And this guy needs to go back at the base, but we're going to, he's got a GUI. So he needs a network card. So what do we got to have to have a network card? We may have to go back to the base to do a couple of little crafter thingies, right? Network card. That's going to be this. So we need a, we need quartz enriched iron. We need an advanced processor and we need paper. So let's take you back to the base, right? We got a couple of things we got to set up back there anyway. We got to get power for this guy and, uh, and all that. So let's go ahead and go back to the, oh, I need to set this so that we can just teleport right back out here, right? So shift click you, open that uh, destination five. So this is Thaumcraft, Thaumcraft. Yeah, Thaumcraft ID five. Cool. Now if I go in here, Thaumcraft, cool. So set this for home, go, right? And uh, let's go ahead and put this other, uh, this other power cell, let's put him down here, someplace, someplace, someplace. Uh, like I guess, I guess right here will be fine. Um, yes. Put him right here for now your input on all sides, yes. So you're charging, that's cool. Uh, and then we want to uh, get a network card. So let's go ahead and get a network card. And while we're at it, we might as well go ahead and put this someplace where it can be on a network. And I think, honestly, I think right here is the best place for that because it's online now, right? So that shouldn't be too difficult to get 
provisioned once we have the right resources. So a network card. Network card needs an advanced processor. So let's get an advanced processor. Yes, please. Start. And then the a network card. We're going to need to set up a recipe for this, but right now I'm just going to go ahead and make it. Uh, we need some more quartz enriched iron. Quartz enriched iron. We're going to need like three of those. Cool. That gives us four. But there is a network card, right? Now this network card, if I'm not mistaken, what I have to do is I have to take and shift click this network card out there at the uh, at the receiver and so that it knows what it's what this block is trying to link to. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go back out to Thongcraft. Go. Yes, I'll oh, see that works. That works swimmingly. I love it. Uh, and then shift click on that or click on that. Does it got a date? Yeah, it does have it. Okay, so it has a uh, it has a destination set to it now. So now we should be able to go back to the home base. And we should be able to set this up so that that now has access. And when we go back out there again, we should be able to hook this grid up and we should have access to our uh, to our network back here, right? So let's get in here and let's put that in there. 952 blocks between this here and that there. How about that? That's a long way. That is a long way. But now when we go out there, out to Thomcraft, yeah, buddy. Now this should be online. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, so we should be able to take and grab one of these and we should be able to do one of, oh, actually we really don't need that, do we? We just need to set this, we just need to hook this up right now. And that should be online, yeah? Oh, baby, that's so cool, right? That is super duper cool. Um, so now we just need to go and get the rest of our stuff and bring it back here, like, like coolness, right? And we should be okay. So let's go back to the base. Uh, not that base. Let's go back to Batania. Because Batania has the Thomcraft stuff, right? It's got the uh, the arcane workbench. I should probably be using an axe on that. We use this on this. That. And then we use an axe on this. Yeah, that works. And then we'll go back like this and go to Thomcraft again. Yay. That's what I'm talking about. Boo ya. That's awesome. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and set these up right here. So give me you, give me you, and give me you. Right? So we're gonna set you up right there. We're gonna set this right here. We're gonna put this right on top of that. We're gonna get some water. We're gonna need another ever full urn, which is fine. We can do that. That's cool. Uh, what did it take to make the ever full urn anyway? I don't remember ever full urn. That wasn't super complicated, but we did make some mistakes with it, right? You're not going to show me the recipe for that? I have to go in the book, don't I? I think I have to go in the book. So farm craft ever full urn. Not there. Yeah, that's the recipe. So it just needs aqua, it needs fabrico, and it needs terra. And fabrico was something that we needed. Uh, that was a crafting station, right? So let's get in here. Let's get some aqua. We needed 10 of those, right? 10 of those. And then uh, crafting station. Just needed one of those, if I recall. And then uh, terra. Needed 30 of those, right? I think that's correct. And then we needed a clay pot. Oh, we don't have any. We don't have any clay pots. Ugh. Anyway, let's go. Let's go get a clay pot, and we'll. Did I make a recipe to make clay? I did not. Or not clay, but uh, bricks. All right. Let's go back to the base. Uh, back to home, please. Let's get some clay. We should have clay here someplace, right? Clay. One, two, three. Smelt those up. Get myself a pot. I must have missed one. Must have missed something. No, not clay. Uh, brick. There it is. Hey, look, I found it. Brick. Get rid of you. Give me that. And then make sure that that's what we needed for that recipe, right? 
And then we're going to do a couple of things in Thalmcraft. So 30, oh, it's 30 Aqua and 10 Terra. Oops. I had that a little off, didn't I? I did. Uh, 10 of those and 30 of those. So Aqua. And how much V are you worth? You're worth 15, so we're going to need some of those quartz crystals, right? To pick up our mess. Yes, please. All right, back to Thumbcraft. Ooh, it's nighttime. It is totally nighttime, and I am going to die. But I'm not going to die. I'm not going to let that happen. Why would I want to die? I don't want to die. Hello? I think we're good. I think we're okay. We're going to find out here in a minute. Uh, yeah, okay. So here, we're going to do uh, one of you, one of you, one of you, and one of you, and then some of you guys. And that is a never full learn. So now we'll put you right there, and you should start filling that guy back up. Perfect. Um, and then the next thing that we need to look at is going to be some uh, some research stuff that needs to happen in, uh, in Thomcraft. So that's what we need to make next. We need to make a, a wood table and turn that into a workbench, right? Uh, the workbench, if I'm not mistaken, is what becomes the research table. Research table, how do we make the research table? Uh, I don't remember, I don't recall. Yeah, that's a wood table. Okay. So, slabs, oh hi, I hear you. I hear you, where are you at? There you are, hi. You're dead, yep, you're dead. All right, so table. Oh, you need to be set for JEI synchronized, and then table. That would be the Thomcraft table. Yeah, this guy. I need slabs, apparently. Nope. Hmm. Let's try this. There it is. So we got that guy, and then we just need, what was the other thing that we needed? We need an ink and quill, right? So our ink bottle from Thomcraft, right? Nope. That's not what it was. It's scribing tools, isn't it? Scribing tools, yeah. So scribing tools. Scribing tools. That should be that should need a glass file. That's easy enough to make, right? And then that should be easy enough to make. Yes, it is. And then we need that Salus Mundus stuff. Salus Mundus should just need one of those, right? If we put this guy down here and then this guy here. Nope. I think we need two of those tables, don't we? So oak. Get rid of that. Get one of those, get one of those, and then get some of these. I think we need two of these. I think that's where the problem is. And if we do that, and then do this, nope. Um, I don't remember how to do this. I, perhaps if we read the instructions, the instructions would be good. All right, so for me to make any progress in as a thaumaturge, I cannot simply rely on studying the world around me. I need to do other things. I need to create a comfortable workspace to do uh, supplies, writing papers, so research table. How do you make the research table? I made wood tables. Do I just put... That's it. I did it. I did it. I did it. I did the thing. There it is, complete, cool. Uh, so now we got those, we got those, and now we can start actually doing research uh, to build our knowledge of Thomcraft. So I didn't need this, did I? I did not, but that's okay, because we can put him we can put him over there someplace and he can do some things, I don't know. Uh, we're probably gonna need to move this guy. 
So we'll put him, put this guy right here, I guess. So you, and then scribing tools. Scribing tools, where'd they go? There they are. Scribing tools. And then we just need paper. So paper. Craft me up a stack of paper if you'd be so kind. Yes, please. And then you can go in there, right? And uh, we can do, we, we want to create a theory. So that theory is going to be experimentation or concentrate. We're going to do experimentation, right? Uh, we're going to do inspired. And then we're going to do reject fundamental findings and experimentation. And I'm trying to get some that don't require us to have a lot of uh, intriguing or weird stuff. But you got to pay attention to what you're doing over here on the side, right? So each one of these theories that you craft is going to give you uh, points towards, uh, towards each of these. So points towards alchemy, points towards... Um, uh, arcane infusion and so forth um, and so we did get a little bit of information towards arcane infusion now what that's doing for us is in here it's making it so that we have more things that we can study uh, in each of these categories right so that is what we say is that so that's good progress for today we got ourselves a new thomcraft area uh, it's a thousand blocks away so if we do create some kind of portal rift or void rift or whatever um, we shouldn't destroy our base. Uh, we got some cool stuff around us that we can use for materials, including a, a great wood tree and a silver wood tree. And I think that's going to do it for today. Folks, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe. The likes and subscriptions help out oh so immensely when it comes to those pesky YouTube search results. The other thing that helps out a lot is comments. So make sure you leave your comments right down here in the comment section below and we'll chat about it. Leave your trips, your trips, your... your tips, your tricks, and your pointers. Boy, try saying that three times fast. Tips, tricks, and pointers on uh, down in the comment section below, and we'll chat about it. Also, don't forget to stop by my Discord server where we talk about all things, uh, all things life, all things gaming, and all things Minecraft. Boy, am I tongue-tied today. But anyway, folks, that is going to do it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, we will catch you on the flip side. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.